excited. I, one of my um, subscribers, Mudbone, M-U-D-B-O-N-E, a uh, YouTube channel named Mudbone, but he has the same 3-F-U-L LaShawn 2 tent that I have, but he also introduced me to a new tent that was, uh, it's a single wall tent, yes. I've been wanting to try one, but I did want to fork over the money to Z-Packs in their um, dual duplex just to see if I like a single wall tent. I didn't, the, the condensation was the issue that was bothering me. But anyway, so Mudbone introduced me to this particular product made by this company here. It's called River Country Products. I think it's a Tracker 2.2. I'll type it up here for you so you know. But I brought my little, I brought my little digital scale. So I'm going to weigh it for us. 2.8 pounds. Okay. Now my, this is my LaShawn 2 in his stuff sack. Everything, the guy lines, the, let's weigh it and see what it weighs. This is the one I usually carry. Okay, 2.6. Now I'm going to open it up for the first time. Yeah, I guess we got instructions here. How to fold your new tent smaller than a football in under two minutes. Anyway, this is kind of the way it's going to look. He says it's easier to set up than my LaShawn stuff sack it came in nice nice big one I don't like folding them up like this here I like just stuffing them in come this football size right here it has a strange feeling to it oh okay here's a little package one two three four five six seven eight 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 step sticks so, put that back in there. Now, there's the guy wires. Oh, yeah. Guy wires come already attached. That's what I was curious about. Okay. All right. That's as far as I'm going with it today. I'll take it to the campsite tonight. Set it up and... Where's the door? <laughs> Where's the door? <laughs> Only one door? Yeah, one door. Oh, this is the back. All right, let me stand it around. Yeah, stand it around. Now, the instruction says to stake out all four corners. Height, it says. Actually, actually, it looks pretty good for a fifty-dollar tent. Yeah, you're right. It, it was a fairly easy setup. I was surprised that part was good. The first thing I noticed, though, not necessarily a deal breaker, but there's no vestibule. For me, my Lashawn two tent. I can unhook the inner, push it to the side, when on a rainy or snowy day, I can cook right down to my tarp. Now, if with this tent, I'll have to bring my 5x7 blue tarp from Walmart. I'd have to bring some more power cord and a couple of step stakes to set up a rain tent. So that's a negative for me that it doesn't have a vestibule. But as far as the tent, I'm, I'm surprised. It's easy set up, and I, I'm going to probably use it a couple of times and give you a some feedback on how it sleeps. 
let me take a look on the inside. Oh, it does zip up. I was thinking it. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're right, Mike. YK zipper. Mm. No YK zipper. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? Hey, 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 mud boy. No YK zippers. <laughs> so, in windy weather, they're gonna dangle to make a little noise, but that's not a, that's not a deal breaker. Mike, this is at least four foot in here. At least four foot. The back. This is where the lock laces work good. There you go. Yeah. Well, only the ventilation is only one. Yeah, that's a that might be an issue. Uh, on the back end, near what near window. I know, I know. I said in the past I would never buy another tunnel tent, tent that had that had a one entrance because I've had some one-person tents and uh, the tunnel that you just had one entrance, and when you got in it to get that sleeping pad onto you, you'd have to be like one of those desert lizards where you raise one foot and one arm and try to stuff it onto you, raise the other foot and the other arm. <laughs> but this is wide enough and big enough inside that I don't think that would be an issue. Now, Mike, my brother-in-law, he he's taught me everything I know about backpacking. I've just watched him and learned, and we both learned together. But for fifty bucks, I think I think Mike is impressed with it. <laughs> really big. Really big. Well, anyway, I think. That, that's my only thing was the um, no vestibule carrying a t have to carry a top now. That's that's the only that's not a deal breaker for fifty bucks. It's really not. I think it's a. I think you did good, and I'm I'm certainly glad you give me uh, clicked me off about it. I didn't mind for fifty bucks because I always wanted to try a, t a single wall tent because I couldn't pull the trigger on Z packs just to try it out and see if I really like it. Now, trekking pole tents, I'm sold on that. I like that. But the condensation was always an issue. Couldn't pull the trigger, mainly because of the condensation. But this would be a $50 trial. And um, I think it's a full season tent, single wall. Uh, women might like it. It's got a little privacy to it. You know, they like to do that, change their clothes and clean up in the tent. So that could work for them. And it's a really, really easy setup. I was surprised. We never set it up before. Just follow the instructions, take our four corners, put up the tracking poles, and guy it out. What a deal. So right now, I'm giving it a thumbs up. It's a thumbs up. Yeah, it's got one storage pocket in the back. Actually, I was looking. I said, I said it was made in America, but I really don't know that. But um, I was looking for, if it was made in China, they'd have to have a little sticker somewhere in there saying made in China. I didn't see it, but also didn't see made in USA in it either. It's so good and the seam sealed, everything. Oh, yeah. Mike says it's seam sealed. He didn't see any loose stitches. So, hey, pretty positive when Mike gives it okay. So let me zip the door, let me zip the door back up. It might roll up as small as a football, but 
I don't want to spend that much time trying to get it. It, it rolled it up. It, it fit on the outside of my backpack just like this. Stuffing didn't work. The material on the flow was too thick, I think. At least Mike seemed to think that. I mean, a good, it's, it's a good deal for 50 bucks, and it's made by this company here, River Country Products, and I'll type it up here for you. All right. Thank you.